Question 1. At the beginning of a football match, the ball is placed at the center of the pitch. The ball will remain still unless it is kicked. This illustrates Newton's A first law, B second law, C third law, D law of gravity. The answer is A Newton's first law. The second question. The abdomen of a housefly contains oviposter in the females at in the males. It contains a thoracic cavity, a vagus, a depositor, and then D sperms. The answer to question two is a vagus. Question three. According to Newton's first law of motion, I, an external force is required to stop a body in motion. I, I, a body in motion will continue at a constant velocity. I, 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 a body at rest requires an external force to be in motion. I, mean, an external force is required to keep a body at rest in its resting state. The answer to question 3. Is let's go through. So I is correct. I I is also correct. I I I is also correct. So a body that is at rest does not need an external force. So the answer to question three is A. Question four. In order to control house flies, we dispose of dead animals, rotten fruits, animals, feces, and other household rubbish. This control method deployed by this approach is the A. Elimination of breeding sites. B. Prevention of contact with food surfaces. C. Biological control method. D. Chemical control method. The answer to question 4 is A. Elimination of breeding sites. Question 5. Ring placement method of fertilizer application involves A. Spreading the fertilizer evenly over the soil B. Placing them on rows of crops C. Applying fertilizer in one or two bands of planted rows D. Placing a quantity of fertilizer at a depth around plants in circles The answer to question 5 is D. The ring placement so, place it in circles question six when the cheek lining from a person's mouth is scraped and observed under a microscope structures that contain nuclei cell membranes and cytoplasms are seen these are a atoms b unicellular organisms c cells d motel organisms the answer to question six is C. Cells. Question 7. The lift force acting on an aircraft weighing 100,000 newton is 75,000 newton. Use the information to answer question 7 and 8. Determine the net force of the plane. So the aircraft weighs 100,000 newton. 100,000 is coming downwards. The question says the lift force. Of the aircraft is this 75,000 so 75,000 is going up now the net force here is asking you to find the um, it was more like the balance if 100,000 is coming down and then 75,000 is going up what happens you would have to subtract the lift force from the Weight of the weight of the aircraft. So you are going to have hundred thousand minus seventy five thousand. And after doing your calculation, if you do it rightly, you are going to have twenty five thousand newton. So A. Question eight. The aircraft will move. The aircraft weighs hundred thousand newton. It's coming down. Then seventy five thousand wants to lift this thing up. This you know huge vehicle up 
there's not enough to lift it. So question eight is downward. Question nine. The greenhouse gases in, include I, water vapor and carbon dioxide. I, I, nitrous oxide and methane. I, 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 chlorofluorocarbons and ozone. Now, I is right. Yes, water vapor is there, carbon dioxide. I, I is also correct. Number nine, CFC and ozone is also correct. So the answer to question nine is C. I, 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 and I, I, I. Question 10. The gastric juice in the stomach helps to A. Churn and mix food. B. Breaks down protein. C. Kills bacteria. D. Protects the stomach lining. So the answer to question 10 is B. Breaks down proteins. Question 11. The physical features of goats include I. Possession of beard I. I. Long hanging tail I. 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 Hair on the body I. I. Both sexes have horns Now Question 11 I is correct I. I is wrong because goats have shorter you know, tails They have hair on their body as well So that's correct Both sexes have horns That's also true Both sexes have horns so question 11, the answer is C. Question 12. A natural phenomenon that shows the blockage of light is A. Eclipse B. Rainbow C. Rainfall D. Echo The answer to question 12 is, is A. Eclipse Question 13. In a tug of war, one side exerts a force of 100 newton and the opposite exerts 90 newton calculate the net force now we've met something like this before a difference in the forces so a difference you know one side is pulling uh, with 100 and the other side is pulling with 90. the net the difference is 10 because 100 minus 90 is 10 so d that's the answer Question 14. Some of the microorganisms found in the soil are bacteria, earthworms, sea termites, and then bee rats. Question 14. You know, the question is asking for micro, small. All of these are macro, it can be seen. So 14 is a bacteria. Question 15. So there's a preamble. A girl of mass 70 kg stood on the first floor of a building of height 1.5 meters. She then ran down at the speed of 2 meters per second. Use the information to answer 15 and 16. Calculate the potential energy. So potential energy equals mass times acceleration due to gravity times height. So the mass of the girl is 70. Solution due to gravity given the question is 10 times the height. So 1.5 meters. 10,050 Joule. So question 15 is C. The next question says, calculate the kinetic energy. Kinetic energy equals half times mass times the velocity squared. So half. Multiply by the mass of the girl, which is 70, times the velocity is what? 2 squared. So, half times 70 is 35. 35 times 4. The 4 is coming from the 2 squared. It's 140. So, question 16. Our answer is B. 140 U. Question 17. The main mechanism in the operation of a bicycle is the A. Lever system, B. Wheel and axle, C. Pulley system, D. Inclined planes. The answer to question 17 is B. Wheel and axle system. 18. Potassium mineral is needed in crops for A. Fruit and flower development, B. Leaf growth, C. Strong stem, D. 
production of starch. Question 18 is for fruit and flower development. So it's A. Question 19. In the water cycle, precipitation refers to A. Formation of clouds. B. Falling of water from the sky. C. Conversion of water to vapor. D. Absorption of water by plants. And that's question 19. This B. Falling of water from the sky. 20. Deforestation disturbs the balance in an ecosystem by A. Increasing the volume of carbon dioxide gases in the atmosphere. B. Reducing the volume of carbon dioxide gases in the atmosphere. C. Depleting food for producers. D. Increasing the amount of water vapor in the atmosphere. Question 20. When you are deforestation is what cutting down of trees. So cut down trees, carbon dioxide is not used up. So the carbon dioxide increases in the atmosphere. 21. The career in science connected with the study of the earth is to be a geologist. Question 22. The direction of movement of heat A is from hotter to colder object. B is from colder to hotter object. C, irrespective of temperature differences and depends on the density of the material. Question 22 is A. It's always moving from the hotter object to the colder object. Law of inertia refers to Newton's first law. Question 23 is A. 24. The process of green manuring entails I, the use of legumes. I, I, plowing green plants into the soil. I, 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 getting rich soil nutrients from decaying plants. So question 24, use of legumes for green manuring is right. Plowing green plants in the soil is also right. Getting rich soil nutrients from decaying plants, that's also right. Because when you are using the legumes, you're actually plowing them. So question 24, can I see? 25, animals depend on plants in order to A, obtain carbon dioxide, B, aid in pollination, C, obtain nutrition and shelter. D. Provide manual to the soil. Question 25. Answer is C. Obtain nutrition and shelter. 26. The primary diet of house fly larvae is A. Fresh fruits. B. Decaying organic matter. C. Leaves. D. Wood. Question 26 is B. Decaying organic matter. 27. Silicon and boron are elements that are A, metals, B, no metals, C, semi-metals, D, no bulk gases. 27, yeah, semi-metals, silicon. 28, the force overcome by a machine is the, the load. 28 is B. 29, silver fish live and hunt with army ants and they share the prey. The relationship can be described as you know, so if they are sharing, um, it's mutualism. No need to read everything. Question 30. A type of semiconductor that allows current to flow in only one direction. Question 30 is a diode. Yes. Question 31. A liquid cannot be handled in the pound because A, it is slippery, B, it flows, C, the particles in it are not packed. D. Its particles have no energy. Answer to question 31. This B. It flows. Oh, simple answer. Question 32. An example of man made ecosystem is A. Desert. B. Crop field. C. Wetland. D. Riverbed. Man made so crop field. So it's B. 33. The storage house of a cell is B. A. Nucleus. B. Mitochondrion. C. Vacuum. D. Cell membrane. Answer to question 33. S. C. Vacuum. The storage house. So success all time. Question 34. Which of the following is not true about the cellulose cell wall of plant cells? A. It gives shape to the cell. B. It is permeable to water gases. C. It is impermeable 
D, it protects and supports the cell. Gen 34, as I see, it's impermeable. 35. In the process of digestion, the stomach I holds food for further digestion. I I destroys microorganisms in the food. I I I produces digestive enzyme. I V turns food for proper digestion. It's in 35. Let's look at it again. So 35 I is correct. Holds food for digestion. Destroys microorganisms. That's also true. Produces digestive enzyme that's also true. Turning of food also happens in the stomach that's also true. So question 35, the answer is D. 36. A rabbit can be described as A. Monogastric carnivore. Not really. B. Ruminant carnivore. No. C. Monogastric herbivore. And D. Ruminant herbivore. A rabbit is a monogastric herbivore because it has just one chain. The stomach feeds on greens. 37. Which electronic component can be polarized and non-polarized? So 37. A. We have a resistor. B. Capacitor. C. Inductor. D. Diode. The answer to question 37 is B. Capacitor. 38. The sickle is used on the farm for A. Transplanting seeds. B. Cutting stems and branches of trees. C. Harvesting crops like rice or wheat. D. Dividing stems into smaller parts. The answer to question 38 is C. Harvesting crops like rice or wheat. 39. One purpose of crop rotation is to A. Increase soil erosion. B. Deplete soil nutrients. C. Control pests and diseases. D. Reduce crop yield. Answer to question 39 is C. The last question. Farmers usually like white sheep because A. They are beautiful and costive. B. The wool is easier to process. C. Their meat is tender. And D. Earth rotating on its axis. Answer is B. 